Hello, welcome to another edition of Let's Move McAllen. I am Mario Reina, the coordinator for health and physical education. Today, we are here at De Leon Middle School. Hi everyone, my name is Liz Northcutt. I'm the CEO and inventor of a children's health and fitness board game that you guys are gonna get to play today. And being a personal trainer, I wanted to figure out a way to inspire my children to love fitness the way that my husband and I do and to get them to emulate the lifestyle that we really wanted to create and have them grow into. And so what we're here today is to share with you that game and also to hope inspire you guys to live a lifestyle that's forward into the health and fitness. We are always looking for a way to provide some nutrition education to our kids in a fun way. And we found that. We brought a game called Lunchbox Kids to the Leon Middle School where the kids have a little fun playing the game, and they also have the opportunity to engage in physical activity. What would you say are the main goals about promoting nutrition and physical activity at the same time? Yeah, the main thing of it is getting on a child's level to where it's fun for them and interesting to them. All right. Ah, uh, looks like we're gonna be doing some exercise. Oh, get up, guys. Hi, oh, oh, everybody. Yeah, everybody's gonna be doing some jumping jacks. I wanna hear y'all count, too. I wanna hear y'all be loud. Y'all ready? Who's starting it? Who's gonna count? Everybody, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine. All right, okay, so y'all get to ask him a question. energy does it take? Now a calorie is the way we measure energy. And so is it A, 3,500 calories for two pounds, or is it B, 7,000 calories for two pounds? What would that be? How much stored energy is in two pounds of fat? What do you think? Uh, B. Yep, you got it right. B, it's 7,000 calories. So you get a golden ticket. We have not from the ticket. <laughs> I like that it was teaching you how nutritional foods would help your body and that it tricked you into exercising. It was fun and it's kind of addicting because it tricks you into playing and exercising and it's a fun way to get active. The main thing I liked about the game was that we can like exercise while doing it and learn nutritional facts. And Which one of these is going to be better for your muscles and your bones and your heart and keep your body healthy? The apple, right? <laughs> not the fruit roll-up. So what we're here today really is to tell you guys that the number one thing that's going to keep you healthy, strong and fit is a choice that you make, a mental choice. It starts from your mental choice. Are you going to choose the apple to eat or the fruit roll-up? So your health and wellness starts from that mental choice. Are you going to work out today are you not? I think it's excellent. It's, it's, the kids were really uh, attentive and interested in um, the health tips that we were getting from our presenters. And they were able to uh, tie in the um, healthy component with the activity component of, our, um, of the program. And they were learning as they were um, being active. As you can see, the kids are having a lot of fun with this game, the Lunch Box Kids game that has given them a lot of information on nutrition 
and they were also had the ability to have some physical activity.